Hey everybody, it's Cheryl Lawson from the Venetian during the International CES show in Las Vegas. It's been a wonderful week. I'm exhausted. I'm surprised I still have a voice, uh, but it's been a wonderful show. Like I said in my uh, last video, the show is really about being connected, uh, the cloud computing. Uh, I really did enjoy the Digital Health Summit and some of the ideas that were coming out of there. There's a long way to go uh, before uh, digital products and services will help people and help us all solve uh, our health related issues and create communities around them. But I think those things have started. Uh, one of my clients, my med lab, is an example of that in, uh, in, in a release that they just sent out. And there were so many other companies in that uh, respect that were really good. You know, if I have to pick a winner here, I'd have to say Samsung. Uh, last year, I would have said it was just Intel. I mean, they had just the greatest things. But um, I would have to say Samsung just dominated uh, from an uh, innovative and creative and you know what's coming next and what they what they uh, announced here that note the uh, Samsung notes where the, it was a tablet slash phone slash uh, drawing tool was just an amazing product the really thin um, ultra books I mean you know it's clear that Samsung Samsung's objective is you know technology world domination and they're really they're getting really close I think the products are great. I really enjoyed, uh, you know, hands-on playing with uh, both the Galaxy Tabs and uh, the Nexus, the Galaxy Nexus, which you know puts my Nexus S to shame. I, I hate to say, but it was really fun. The other things that were coming out in some of the smaller companies, just some really innovative, uh, uh, you know, uh, apps and um, uh, programs to help us stay connected. And I hate to say it, but you know, social and um, internet computing was even more prevalent than last year. Remember, I talked about how everything was going to be connected. Uh, your television, your car, your washer dryer, we're all going to be able to send you a text whenever it was finished, or turn off the light if you've left it on, or do something else that will um, change the way we view typical and traditional uh, appliances, computers, and everything. So uh, there was a sign in the hall over at the convention center that said, you know, you didn't, you didn't, why didn't you know you didn't need this or you needed this or something like that? And I thought it was really telling in one of the Tweet House sessions, it was the same thing. You don't know that you need that one technologically advanced, technological advancement until it's here. And then a few months later, we can't figure out how we survived without it. So um, a CES is overwhelming. It is, uh, you know, a, a, a delight for the senses and a little bit of pain on the body with all the walking. But uh, I did get a lot more rest last night than the night before. So hopefully the closing events tonight will be uh, fun and, and uh, I'll get on a plane and head home tomorrow. So thanks for everybody who followed my tweets as much as I could do from the convention center and are watching the videos on YouTube and Vimeo and hopefully I'll get some more uploaded between now and the next few weeks. Thank you so much. Have a great day.